Hello friends, in this session we'll be taking a look at the differences between Comunda Platform 7 which was earlier just called Comunda or Comunda 7 and Comunda Platform 8. So Comunda 7 has been there for 9 years. Comunda 8 is based on Comunda Cloud 1.4 and was announced in April of 2022. Comunda 7 is only guaranteed for additional 5 years, but both the versions coexist and are available. Comunda Platform 7 and Comunda Platform 8, both of them contain a process engine at its core, though the engine is different for both of them. Both products are very flexible, developer-friendly solutions where software developers are involved in the process of development, as opposed to so-called low-code suites. The differences I'll highlight in terms of various capabilities, for example, the engine, architecture and task processing, communication, operating options, etc. So in terms of engine, Comunda 7 is based on a fork from Activity Engine, whereas in Comunda 8, it's based on GB Engine, which is a self-developed and it's supposedly scalable horizontally and linearly because of Elasticsearch-based backend instead of a DBMS system, which was the case for Commander 7. In terms of architecture and task processing, Commander 7 has shared engine, embedded engine, and remote engine, whereas in Commander 8, only remote engine is available. Task processing in Commander 8 is always asynchronous, wherein, whereas in Commander 7, it can be synchronous also. Commander 7 uses REST API to talk to the engine, whereas Commander 8 uses gRPC protocol, which is available in Java and .NET frameworks. Task list called Cockpit in Commander 7 now has GraphQL based APIs, which make it uh, embeddable in headless solutions. Operating options, com com Commander 8 is a complex setup consisting of larger number of components as compared to Commander 7. Commander 8, only provi Commander 8 provides SaaS and on-premise versions which run on Kubernetes clusters or development environment on Docker-based containers. Commander 7 does not have a SaaS offering. Connectors, out-of-box connectors are available which can be placed directly in modeler with only configurations and no code are available. For example, SendGrid, AWS Lambda, and around 10 to 15 connectors are available. You can develop your own connectors also. A basic support for developing and operating your own connectors is provided, which is expected to enhance over time. What's missing? Execution listeners are not available in Commander 8. BPM and implementation, BPM and conformance is restricted in Commander 8. It's not as complete as Commander 7, but this should change over time as it iterates over its development cycle and more and more features will be added to it. So it's uh, very different from Commander 7 in a lot of terms. And it's kind of a remake of Commander. Thank you.